category. Alright, what's up, Tubies? Okay, this is my last tag. It is 3.51 in the morning. Yes, I'm still up because I'm not sleepy. Okay, so these are my top 10 pet peeves. And I think I did this before, like a long, long time ago. Um, I don't know, but I'm pretty sure I have some new ones. <laughs> But this is my top 10 pet peeves. This is a tag. And yes, I'm tagging all of you. Um, so, number one. My number one. I'm not putting them in any order. So, I'm just going to say number one. My first pet peeve. Let me see. Um, I hate when, like, people call you and call you and call you like if you're not home and they keep calling or if you in a store somewhere where you can't answer your cell phone and then you see them or you finally talk to them and be like why you didn't answer your phone and blah 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 they act like you don't you know what i'm saying have a life and what i hate is like they keep calling you but they never leave a voicemail they just keep calling and calling and calling and calling and if it's that important Leave a voicemail. I will call you back when I get time. My second pet peeve. Let me see. I hate when like you see somebody. You be out. You see somebody or whatever. And they be like, where you been? I ain't seen you in so long. And you know what I'm saying? You be like, well, you know, I be at home. Obviously, if you wanted to know where I been or whatever, you know where I stay at. So... If it was that important that you wanted to see me, you would come by my house and see me. I mean, I'm not, I don't go out to clubs anymore. I'm in a relationship, so I don't see no need to just be hanging all out at the basketball court and doing all that stuff because I really don't fool with nobody. So obviously, if you miss me that much and want to see me, you know where I stay. Okay, my number three pet peeve is Yahoo Messenger. And I know I've said this plenty of times. When I'm on Yahoo Messaging and you keep buzzing and buzzing and buzzing me. That pisses me off. Do not buzz me. If I answer you, I answer you. If I don't, obviously I'm going to see the box up on there. I will hit you back. If I'm not logged on, I will get the offline messages. Don't buzz me. Because I, for one, I just think that's rude. If I tell you like, look. Um, I'm laying down, but I'm turned away from the computer, or I'm not sitting right next to the computer, buzz me. That's when I tell you to. But don't just keep buzzing me and buzzing me and buzzing me and shit. I don't like that. Number four. Um, let me see. Number four. If I'm up, I don't care if I'm up 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 o'clock in the morning. I'm 28. Don't ask me what you doing still up. I'm a grown woman. You know what I'm saying? It, it pees me because I don't ask you what you doing up, you know. I'm not going to be like, well, ain't it past your bedtime? Obviously, we grown people. We can stay up as late as we want to. Last time I checked, I had my own house. So, I don't even know. My mama don't even ask me how long you stay up or whatever. So, don't ask me what I'm doing up or how long I've been up. Sometimes, I'm not sleepy. I don't want to sleep. Sometimes, I can't sleep. You know, if I can't sleep and I want to go to sleep, I mean, I can take a sleeping pill and go to sleep. But if I want to be up, I'm watching TV, I'm chilling on a computer, that's my business. So, was that number four? Yeah. All right. <laughs> so, number five. Um, number five. Number five. Number five. Number five. Hold up, y'all. I know I got something. <laughs> um, number five. My number five pet peeve is I'm I'm a neat freak. So I hate when somebody come on my house and move something or go in my kitchen rambling for stuff and don't put stuff back how you got it. That's a big pet peeve because I hate that. Like, I know how I got every single thing placed in my house. If anything is out of place moved or whatever you can cut i might have a little ocd i don't know <laughs> but i'm just like a neat freak like that and i don't like anything out of place i don't like clutter none of that um number six 
my number six pet peeve um as i hate when people on youtube or whatever anywhere but i think youtube that's the worst case of negativity that that's on any site period as far as what i see because it's people that leave negative comments on your videos and then when you go to their page they ain't even got no damn picture that pisses me off <laughs> because if you ain't got no picture on your page how the hell you gonna call somebody fat how the hell you gonna call somebody ugly how you, how the hell you gonna say any damn thing about anybody when you ain't got not one video or one picture up on your damn uh page you know that's stupid ass shit i don't like that let me see i think i'm on number seven um oh <laughs> number seven I hate when somebody don't even talk to you, or they barely even fool with you, or you might see them once a month, or not even that, but when they want something from your ass, when they want to borrow something, or need something, that's when they want to call you. Don't do that. Don't do that. Because if you don't fool with me now, other day, or whatever, don't call me asking me, can you borrow this, can you borrow that, oh, can I come over your house and use this and use that? No, don't use me. I don't like that. <laughs> so, number, um, where I'm at, number eight, um, number eight, I hate when somebody asks you for a ride and they ain't never got no damn gas money. That's crazy because these people, they be like, can I have a ride here and there? Yeah, you can have a ride. I mean, you got some gas money. No, I ain't got no gas money. Gas is damn near $3. You ask me for a ride, you ain't got no gas money. So I'm sorry for you. Number, uh, wait a minute. Number nine. My number nine pet peeve is... I don't know. I think I'm stuck on the last two. Wow, my number nine pet peeve is lame ass pickup lines from sorry ass men. Because if you coming to me trying to hit on me and then you going to my friend or my cousin and going to the next person and the next person, or even on the computer, I see a man ask me, you know, what's up, baby, and then you go to another girl page and he done said the same shit to her and the same shit to the next one, next one. I hate that shit. I hate that too. So my number ten pet peeve is hmm my number 10 pet peeve why is um i think my number 10 pet peeve is why i hate when people ask when you when somebody asks you something and then you give them the answer and they ask you why 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 this why that I do it to a certain extent. It depends on the caliber of the question. But like if if you ask me, um so what are you doing today? Oh, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that, or go shopping, blah blah blah, whatever. Why? What do you mean why? Like there's no there's no answer after why. It's because I want to. Shit, so why ask me why? <laughs> so that will have to be my number 10, I think. Yeah, so those are my top 10 pet peeves. So um, y'all let me know what y'all pet peeves are. And uh, post a video response, whatever. And I am tagging everybody. So see y'all. Twister, stand Gotta give me fun, gotta give me fun, yeah So I can creep up on her, so I can ease up on her So I can get touch and feel it Put a dip in your back, can you give me one? So the whole gym, the whole gym, yeah Gotta give me fun, gotta give me one, yeah So I can creep up on her, creep up on her Everybody's trying